welcome to the latest Times Aerospace TV Spotlight programme. Today, we're focusing on one of the industry's hottest topics. That's, of course, the aftermarket, where solutions that make product availability and bring customer service to the fore are always welcome and needed. Now, L3 Harris is making a stronger play in the aftermarket, especially around the used equipment business, an area where it has historically not had a major focus. And I'm delighted to welcome Adrian Paul, Vice President Customer Services to the programme to discuss how L3 Harris is doubling down in this field. Thank you, Mark. Happy to be here. Welcome, Adrian. Thank you for joining us. Now, can you tell us why L3 Harris has decided to take a stronger role in the aftermarket and services space? Well, Mark, we've clearly been laser focused on the airframers for many years. And whilst we've had an aftermarket presence, we're really being customer driven now in terms of expanding the services and the offerings that we're provided, that we're providing. Um, And a lot of that is really around geography right now, in as much as we've had a limited footprint of how customers can access us. And with the successes we've had with the avionics sales in particular, we're we're now, you know, being encouraged to open up in various different regions. And which are the most popular products that your customers want you to focus on? Well, we've obviously got a very strong presence around recorders, but also in terms of the the TCAS products um, and, you know, the the, the, the general portfolio of, of safety products that we provide. Now, as you've said, this is a global initiative, but how will you roll it out? Yes, exactly. Yes, Mark. Um, it's essentially, we've already positioned ourselves through a, a partnership with OEM services to put spares in various locations around the world so that it speeds our response when rotables are required. But in addition, we're currently in active discussions with partners of establishing repair capability um, in the Asia Pacific and European theatres. And what is the timeline for this onboarding process? We're currently in negotiations and discussions, um, heavily involved in customer service planning to understand where the demand um, will be met regionally. And we're in active discussions, meeting with potential partners, and we expect to announce those during the course of next year. Now, I understand L3 has recently launched something called Sky Parts Global. Now, where does that fit in here, Adrian? And why is yes. that important for customers? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we're very excited about that in particular, Mark, in as much as we've traditionally not really participated in the used equipment market, although we've been aware of it. And having done our research, we recognize there's a significant amount of activity. And we, we, we launched it recently and just dipping our toe in the water by understanding which products customers are looking for in a used serviceable condition, um, we're already enjoying excellent, um, excellent sales around used equipment. And it, again, this is customer driven because it fills out our portfolio Sometimes if you've got um, aging products in the customer's portfolio um, and, it, and the repair is expensive, sometimes a, 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 a replacement which is pre-owned is excellent. And we obviously put the full bumper to bumper warranty around it, which is something that other people could not do. So we're finding that the, the, the privileges of being uh, an OEM allow us to make very strong commitments to customers about the credentials of our equipment that we're offering in a used um, equipment state. Now, L3 is clearly making a big play in the aftermarket here. Can you describe where you want to be in this space in in the next couple of years, please? Yes, well, we want to be differentiated through customer service. Um, And that's why, you know, the customers have a choice, right? Many of the products we provide, whether it's a simulator or a TCAS computer, they have choices. And so we see this as a clear opportunity to differentiate because of better services, more responsiveness. And so um, this is going to be an exciting time to be part of our organization as we really spool up the customer focus, expand our geographic reach and increase the number of service offerings that we're putting in front of customers. Adrian, thank you very much 
for sharing your strategy, for sharing L3's strategy with Spotlight today, and good luck as you build up your new business segment. And thank you everybody for watching this latest Spotlight programme.